Hi, this is Bill Colhane from our BidPrime headquarters. Over the years, we've looked at the intelligent transportation systems industry and how federal, state, and local governments have had an impact on the growth of ITS. Just this past week, I spoke with Brian Palish from the American Society of Civil Engineers, and we discussed what's going on with U.S. infrastructure. As many of you are aware, there's been a call for reducing the $2 trillion gap in investment in infrastructure in the United States. In short, there may be hope. As I've traveled around the country over the past year, literally from coast to coast, similar to you, I've seen numerous examples of ITS in use. Everything from management systems, signal control solutions, message signs and ALPR, automatic license plate recognition, there's a topic we've reported on a number of times over the past years. ITS includes systems and solutions for monitoring activity. A few weeks ago, we looked at CCTV and how it plays a role in surveillance. Well, CCTV is a tool in ITS as well. Our friends up north know that de-icing systems are also included under the wide umbrella that we call ITS. Let's talk numbers. At this very moment in our Bid Prime database, we see hundreds of active related bids, RFPs submitted by all levels of the public sector, and businesses are taking advantage. Numerous companies, both large and small, are finding out about the opportunities and providing the equipment, services, and expertise in demand from these U.S. agencies. As you see in the list of sample bids we've listed here, the requests are varied and plentiful, as I mentioned. With federal, local, and state government investment and emphasis on improving the infrastructure and demand from people across the country, far and wide, expect ITS providers to have an ever-increasing busy 2019. So there's the latest. Go right here to search the bids and RFPs. On behalf of everybody at BidPrime, all the best in growing your business.